Employees and customers had to run for it when fire broke out at a Denny's this morning. CBS 2's Jasmine Veal is live at that restaurant in Temple City with a look at all that damage there. We can see it behind you, Jazz. Yeah, and look at that, Sharon. Thankfully, no one heard, but this Denny's destroyed. It is still smoking at this hour. This restaurant has been a staple in this community since the 80s. It was just recently re remodeled. Now, all gone. Pieces of this Denny's restaurant collapsing as it's engulfed by flames early this morning in Temple City. More than a dozen fire engines raced to the scene. The flames were so intense, LA County firefighters tried to get inside but had to back off when the front wall fell down. You'll hear some cracking of the beams and things uh, as it's happening. Three employees and a handful of customers also got out before the flames overtook the building. No one was hurt. I'm very scared when they see. Nermeen Sawiers and her husband couldn't believe their eyes when she dropped him off for what was supposed to be his morning shift at Denny's. What happened? I don't know. Now he and a couple dozen other employees are afraid they will be out of work for a long time. It's hard for a no job. Yeah, we have a family. What happened? I don't know. No, no money now. <laughs> Arson investigators are trying to figure out what started the massive fire. A fire wall protected the bank next door. Neighbors and customers who heard the news stopping by the scene this morning. It's just a, a shame. We used to come here quite often. And I was thinking of coming here this Sunday. Believe it or not, like I said, I hadn't been here in 30 years, but I don't think I'll be coming here now. And one employee inside at the time of this fire said he initially smelled gas and then saw smoke coming out of the attic. I also spoke to the manager of the Denny's. He says, yes, he does plan to rebuild, but it's going to take at least six months.